At this time, we ask that you please rise for the presentation of colors, followed by the national anthem. At this time, please welcome the principal of Rancocas Valley Regional High School, Mr. Joseph Martin. Good evening, and a heartfelt welcome to the commencement ceremony of the Rancocas Valley Regional High School class of 2019. This evening, the light is shining on our senior class. No more rain. Graduation night certainly is a special one. Students, your hard work, your intelligence, your character, your perseverance. Tonight is your payday. Be proud of what you have achieved and know that your principal could not be more proud of you tonight. Please savor every minute of this ceremony. Before we move on with the program, I would like to introduce the following people. Assistant Principal, Mr. Bill Booth. Assistant Principal, Mr. Ron Wentz. Senior Class Advisor, Mrs. Carolee Gray. Class President, Javian Kendrick. Javian is from the Lumberton Sunning District and will be attending Stockton University, majoring in business management. At RV, he has been involved in student council, red and white night captain, track, and vice president of the Civic Engagement Club. <laughs> student Council President, Anjane Russell Hopkins. Anjane is from the Mount Holly Sunning District and will be attending Rutgers University, majoring in public health. Anjane was involved in student council, Big Brothers, Big Sisters, NHS, 
365 Afro, and student liaison to the Board of Education while attending Harvard. Val Victoria, Maisha Malia. From the Lumberton Sunning District, Maisha will be attending Rutgers University, majoring in biology. She was involved in Model UN, NHS, National Spanish Honor Society, Math National Honor Society, and Interact Club while attending our group. Salutatorian, Morgan Pugliese. Morgan is from the Lumberton Sunny District and will be attending Randolph Macon College this fall where she will major in biology and chemistry. During her time at RV, Morgan was involved in NHS, National Spanish Honor Society, Math National Honor Society, and President of the Internet Club. And finally, I would like to call to the podium and welcome our superintendent, Dr. Chris Miley. Thank you, Mr. Martin. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to the 2019 Red Cocos Valley Regional High School District graduation ceremony. I'm very pleased to represent Red Cocos Valley to present the class of 2019. Tonight, we celebrate the culmination of public education that started for many of our 2019 graduates when they entered kindergarten in the sending school districts of East Hampton, Haynesport, Lumberton, Mount Holly, or West Hampton 13 long years ago. First, I'd like to introduce some special guests attending the celebration this evening. On stage with us, from the Rancocas Valley Regional High School District Board of Education, Board of Education President, representing West Hampton, Mr. Chip Miller. Our Board of Education Vice President, representing Lumberton, Ms. Diane Solon. In the seating in front of the stage, representing Lumberton, Mr. Lewis Don. Board of Education representing Haynesport, Mr. Eric Fuger. And also representing Mount Holly, Mr. Dick Alimo. Board of Education, thank you for your commitment to the Rancocas Valley students and student body. We would not be able to provide the outstanding RV experience without your committed service. I'd like to take this time to introduce former RV board member, currently the Burlington County Executive Superintendent and proud parent of soon-to-be graduate, Mr. Darrell Minus Vincent. Next, school district administration with us celebrating the graduates down in the crowd. I'd like to introduce our Director of Curriculum and Instruction, Mr. Bill Connolly. On stage with us, our Director of Rancocas Valley Personalized Readiness and Education Program, RV Prep, Ms. Vanessa Meekins. Finally, our Director of Special Services, Ms. Kelly Scapolato. Thank you for being here. Community leaders, Board of Education members, administrators, and teachers from the Sending District and the Rancocas Valley Regional High School District have come together tonight to celebrate this once in a lifetime occasion for our graduates. First, let me try to illustrate the type of class that you have in front of you with a few numbers and accolades. We have a total of 532 graduates receiving diplomas this evening. Each one of them took an average of 134 credits while at RV. Combined, they took advantage of and challenged themselves with 524 advanced placement courses and over 102 college acceleration program courses receiving college credits while still in high school. 
the class of 2019 will be attending 122 different colleges or universities across the country next year. And during that time, the class of 2019 will be receiving 13,354,987 dollars in scholarship money. And then just a few weeks ago, to add to that, $130,000 in scholarship money with 242 local senior scholarships. Great job. So, Furthermore, we have 15 members of the class of 2019 that will be committing the noble act of fighting for our country by enlisting in a branch of the Armed Services College ROTC program or one of the military academies this summer and next. Thank you for your commitment to serve. This year, in Performing Arts, we were presented with Stairs to the Roof, the Classic of Chicago. We had our choral concerts, jazz, percussion, and instrumental concerts, the RV dance show, and of course, the Battle of the Bands, and a number of other performances highlighting the talents of RV students. In athletics, we had six athletic conference championships, one sectional championship, and one very special Team New Jersey State Championships. Thank you to our female track athletes, Coach Warren and the staff. Congrats to the girls for being the best in New Jersey. Most important, the class of 2019 represents a class that volunteered an indeterminate amount of community service, hours raising an astounding amount of money for charities and the less fortunate. Let's give the class of 2019 another big round of applause. These graduates benefited from teamwork that provided the support system of passionate teachers, coaches, counselors, advisors that empowered every student to be the contributing members of the society that are about to become Grand Cocos Valley High School alumni by the end of this evening's ceremony. And of course, that support system wouldn't be complete without the crucial caring guidance of parents, guardians, and families. Parents, guardians, and families, this is an emotional time for all of you. Pride, excitement, anxiety, and of course happiness as you watch all of our graduates, our young adults, cross the stage tonight. I know you will have visions or memories of them when they were playing in elementary school field days together, dance recitals together, t-ball games, music recitals, or you may have a flashback to the eighth grade graduation when it seemed like this day, high school graduation day, was so far away. You will then snap to reality that your children have grown and all of a sudden they are the young adults sitting before us this evening. A lot has happened over 13 years since kindergarten, and many of you have probably been thinking about those memories and events that will last forever. As you reflect on the last 13 school years, the future that lies ahead for your children, and I know that you tell your children that you are proud of them for what they have accomplished. I want you to know, families, we are very proud of you, too. The partnership between the school district and home is vital, and you did it. Parents, guardians, families, congratulations to you and the job that you have done. Graduates, one of the best things about this night is that all graduates are equal, receiving the same diploma, signed and sealed, ready to send you off to the real world. Every single one of our 532 graduates receives the same coveted Grand Cocos Valley District Diploma. The diploma represents opportunity, the sky is your limit, and you should reach for the stars. After all of those accomplishments that I just read, I'm going to give you four items that you can take away tonight. Over the years, my advice to graduates has been traditional. It has been about taking advantage of this opportunity, 
the great benefit of simply working hard, about dreaming big, and don't ever let anyone tell you that you can't. And of course, some of my graduation themes have been about the fact that with over 500 of you going out into the communities around the globe, you can truly change the world. This graduation, however, is a little different, as I see that you and the world around us need something a little bit different. We can see by what you have done this year and all of your accomplishments that you are extremely busy, driven, young adults. But at times, that comes with stress. The inability to take care of yourself and the inability to be present for the people you care about. And sometimes, we just can't be the kind person that we want to be because we aren't thinking about it. Don't let life and aspirations get in the way of taking care of you. The prolific author Kurt Vonnegut quoted an updated version of Stop and Smell the Roses by saying, when things are going sweetly and peacefully, stop for a moment and say, if this isn't nice, what is? A good balance between your goals and living life seems to be one of the biggest problems across our country. How do you take care of yourself and create balance between your goals and just living life? A few things that you can do to do that. First. Know your strengths and stay within yourself. Another way of saying, be you. Don't ever try to be what you think others want, as this is an impossible task and leads to more anxiety than we can handle. Don't overcommit yourself. If you feel as though what you committed to stresses you out, read the best-selling book, The Art of Saying No, by Damon Zaharis. As he says, Start taking control of your life by learning to say that simple, beautiful word, no. Second piece of advice, graduates, stay active. Nothing is better for helping you to cope with things than regular exercise. A walk, a bike ride, a hike, just something that you enjoy. The evidence is clear. Being active reduces the risk of disease, reduces stress, makes you feel better and sleep better. And from the words of John F. Kennedy, physical fitness is not only one of the most important keys to a healthy body, it is the basis of dynamic and creative intellectual activity. Third, as we work toward increasing our technology one-to-world initiative as an instructional and learning tool here at Grand Cookies Valley, we also need to learn how to unplug and be present with others at the same time. Personally, I admit that I'm working, I'm guilty of this, and I'm working on this. As our world is full of the most technologically advanced communication 24 hours a day with Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, texting, and oh yeah, that archaic method of email, it is addictively consuming. It's quite frankly disappointing when I am out and about and I see groups of people or just a couple sitting together but they are all on their smartphones, not saying a word, not present with each other, not listening to each other. Unplug and don't lose the lost art of conversation, listening and be present for others. It is research proven that unplugging improves communication, improves sleep, energy and connections with others. Balance between technology connectedness and personal connectedness is the key. Former technology giants like Bill Gates and the late Steve Jobs proposed that balance with their families. The great writer and novelist Ray Bradbury said simply, too much of anything isn't good for anyone. Good advice if you really think about that. And last graduates, be kind to others. We know the statistics that it actually takes more energy to frown than it does to smile. We know that simple acts of kindness actually increase endorphins and help our personal well-being. It's documented in medical journals that simple random acts of kindness increase energy, happiness, and your lifespan, and decrease pain, stress, anxiety, and depression. That is amazing, isn't it? Helping others with acts of kindness actually helps you more. So remember, take care of number one, yourself. Stay active, unplug, and be kind. A recipe for a healthy success, but not the traditional graduation advice from me as the superintendent. Use the skills and experiences that you acquired here at Rank Cookies Valley to become a contributing member of this community or another. In closing, we are very proud of you and we are looking forward to the contributions that you will make. 
to each of the graduates of the class of 2019, I wish you success, good health, and the best of luck. Thank you. At this time, please welcome the Student Council President, Ajene Russell Hopkins. graduating class 2019. Welcome to graduation. We could not have done it without them. Today, we sit as students with very different perspectives than those who went through the doors of our being expression. Today, the people who have stood behind us for all of our trials, errors, successes, and failures watch us accomplish one of our first feats of many. Among us, there are future scholars, athletes, teachers, doctors, engineers, and so many, many more. No matter what new road we are embarking on, the horizons extend far beyond what we can see. Anything is possible. 5,110 days ago, we were graduating preschool with milk mustaches and kissing naps goodbye. Today, while milk mustaches are for the most part extinct, the naps, for many of us, live on. <laughs> Again today, we are being asked to say goodbye to the familiar and step into the future with great expectations. In the next 60 days, some of us will settle into our dorms, head off to basic training, learn a trade, or join the workforce. For the very first time, we will become independent, contributing members of society. Although that may sound somewhat scary, the RV staff has equipped us with the resources, knowledge, and tools that we will need to be successful. They set the ball high, and we rose to the challenge. For that, we will be forever grateful. A special thanks also needs to be extended to our friends and family. Your love and support have also played a vital role in our journey to this day. Lastly, it's time for us to celebrate our own accomplishments. Be proud of all that you have done and how far you've come. Congratulations on obtaining your first job, being accepted to college, becoming a better person, earning the grade, and overcoming some of your biggest fears. You did it even when you thought you couldn't. You all deserve to be celebrated. I am so proud of all of us. Everyone believed we could, and we did. Congratulations. And now, please welcome the 2019 class president, J.B. Kendrick. All right, uh, buckle up, guys. I got 50 pages to go, so make sure you're ready. It's a joke, I'm kidding. Uh, all right, good evening, everyone. Before I start, can we all just give a hand to our graduates? Life is an open book. Each day is a chapter, each hour a paragraph, and each second a sentence. Four years is a long time. It's a lot of chapters and it's a lot of depth. Kind of like the textbooks that they give here, but way more interesting depending on the person you are. To my class, the class of 2019, we've had some good times. We got pretty late. I think the one thing that I love most about you guys is that we all have respect for each other, especially at big events like Red and White Night, Homecoming, Prom, and Senior Trip, where we all just saved the drama for our mamas and came together to have a good time. Some great examples of this are the lightsaber fight at the Fountain in Disney, or our very last skit for Homecoming that took place, took place right on this very turf. Memories that were added to our books forever. Memories that we can reflect on. It seems like senior year just began yesterday, and now we're standing here, and the future is waiting for us at our doorsteps, ready to welcome us with open arms. We now ask ourselves, what's next? What comes after? 
I mean, of course, a good amount of us are going to college, the military, and others will start working right away, but does that really explain what life holds for us after this? You see, the word after has a bigger meaning than you'd expect it to have. A for acceptance, F for failure, T for time, E for enjoyment, and R for resilience. Each of these words holds a sneak peek of what life will have for us down the road. Acceptance, accepting that life will place thousands of obstacles in your way, but it is your choice if you want to go over, under, around, or let it block you. I'm sure every single person sitting in those seats right now has hit some obstacles throughout their time in RV, and even in life. Obstacles have molded and shaped us into the people we are right now, especially if we accept these trials and tribulations for what they are and conquer them instead of making excuses. Without obstacles, we will not learn in life. And if we don't learn, we won't be shaped into new people. We can't grow. We also can't not grow if we don't encounter failure, something that everyone fears. For the past 12 years, we've heard the word, and it's been pressed into our conscience that we cannot accept it, that it is a disease waiting to tear our success apart. But failure holds the key to success. Before we go off and enter our new worlds, new lives, and new routines, we need to understand that life will not only become a bit more difficult, but that failure will also become more persistent. So class of 2019, I ask you, Will you let failure knock you down at your feet? Or will you step back, run, and jump right over that obstacle onto the next one? And after that, the next one. And after that, the next. See, the problem with today is that we do not believe in ourselves enough. We as youth have the power to do and achieve anything we put our minds to. And we have plenty of time to do it. Time is a friend and can also be an enemy. It's positive and negative, and depending on how we use it is where the balancing scale will tip. Procrastination becomes your best friend in high school, can't you agree? I know all of us have had our fair rounds of procrastinating projects, homework, and shoot, in school itself. But in order to attain success, you must make procrastination your enemy. Laziness is the failure to recognize how important your goals are to you. Time may feel like forever, but life is short. Instead of letting it go to waste, learn how to use it to your advantage. Although life is full of tribulations, it is also okay to set aside time for enjoyment. Now I am proud to say that most of you in the crowd know how to have a good time and to appreciate the things, people, and opportunities that surround you. As we go on our separate paths, we must remember that our time to be young is running to its end, so we must learn how to enjoy every moment. I understand life throws stressful predicaments at us, but even though it seems hard, we must learn how to look at the bright side. If we do not learn how to search for the positive and the negative, then we will be swallowed by the darkness. R is the last letter in the word after, and this stands for resilience. As mentioned before, obstacles are a common commodity in each and every one of our lives. Resilience is the ability to not only jump over these obstacles, but to learn from them and to not make the same mistake again. Now I know, and I apologize for sounding like your parent, but I feel that it is important for us to understand these things. Our future holds exciting challenges and rewards for us, and I can't wait to see the big things that each and every one of you accomplish. As your class president, I wish the best to you all, and I love each and every single one of you. Before I close, I leave you with this one thing. Although we are leaving this place for the years to come, let us never forget the place that we call home. Class of 2019, congratulations, and thank you for the adventures, thank you for the love, and most importantly, Red Devil Nation forever. Now please welcome the salutatorian, Morgan Puglisi. Good evening to parents, grandparents, grandparents, relatives, friends, faculty, and the class of 2019. 
After all this time, we're finally done high school. All the homework is over, the tests are done, and there are no more finals, at least until college. I know we hear it all the time, but I really do feel as though the memories we've made and the lessons we've learned at RV will stick with us for the rest of our lives. While I may not remember much from Algebra 2 or Calculus BC in 10 years, or even in one year, I will remember the valuable advice from each of my teachers about college, careers, and life in general. And I will remember how much they cared about my success, both academically and as a person. I am incredibly thankful to have gone to a school with such an excellent academic program, and I am honored to speak on this stage today. Right now, we're entering that phase between waves, where we've completed our senior year and we don't belong to a high school anymore, but the next wave is coming soon, whatever it may be. No longer will we have the structure of high school, but instead a structure which we develop ourselves. The parents who have watched over our every step to guide our success, and the teachers who have relentlessly helped pave our way to graduation will not be there to guide us in everything we do. We owe everything to them, and without their persistent guidance, we will soon realize just how big of an impact they've had on us. As for our next wave, some of us are heading to more school because we haven't had enough. Others to the workforce, some to the military, and some who aren't quite sure yet. Regardless of everyone's plans, senior year has made me more aware of the pressure which is on students our age to make decisions to define the rest of our lives. Where are you going? What will you do? Who are you going to be? At the same time, I've become increasingly aware of how silly it is to try and stick ourselves into one set path for the rest of our lives at 18 years old, as if we have any idea what we're doing. Most of us haven't seen a quarter of our lives yet, and here we are, so incredibly concerned over what we will do after high school, because we think our decision now will be it for the rest of our days. The thing is, life isn't set up like a straight line of dominoes determined by your expectations and the expectations of those around you. It isn't one step that you set up which leads immediately into another, which leads into another. It's whatever you want it to be. And your path includes a few detours and redirections here and there. That doesn't mean you won't be successful. We get so caught up in our perfect plan that we're devastated when anything in it fails. But the truth is, we have time to change, and we have more leeway than we think. As we embark on the next phase of our lives, remember to always consider what's going to make you happiest before you settle on a path that you think is the only one for you. And don't be afraid to embrace change when it comes your way. To quote Dr. Seuss, you have brains in your head, you have feet in your shoes. You can steer yourself in any direction you choose. You're on your own, and you know what you know. And you are the one who will decide where to go. Thank you all, and congratulations to the class of 2019. At this time, please welcome the Rand Cocos Valley Regional High School, Class of 2019, Val Victorian, Maisha Malia. Hi everyone. Since I know how much we all want to go celebrate with our family and friends after graduation, I'm going to try to make this short. Congratulations, Class of 2019. We made it. I would like to sincerely thank all of our teachers and staff for supporting and guiding us these past four years. I would also like to thank the parents who are here tonight. Without your love and encouragement, we really would not have made it up to this point, considering all of the stress and uncertainty tied to the high school experience. To be honest, I thought about what to say in this speech for a good two weeks. 
in the end, I decided to speak about something which has defined my high school experience. Although being at RV has taught us a lot of great things, I feel that the one thing we can all attest to over the last four years is the importance of living each moment to the fullest and uh, making the best memories ever. Whether it was stepping into an A-push class the first day of freshman year and actually staying there for 10 whole minutes before realizing you're in the wrong place, or uh, tripping, up the tripping up the stairs senior year, I'm sure we've all had our fair share of high school memories we prefer not to remember. However, what we should be more focused on are the good times we have spent with incredible people. What I will take away from my time at the school when I leave for college are the hilarious, random, and beautiful everyday moments, not the exhausting assignments and exams. One of the most important things in life is valuable memories. I say this because while all things end at some point, the memories made will help us flourish as we move on to more exciting adventures. Our school has given us an endless source of wonderful moments. I have to admit that debating whether or not all stop signs were indeed yield signs in AP Bio or drinking freshly brewed Fritagian coffee in A Push are experiences I will not be forgetting anytime soon. The Double Dash, in particular, holds a special place in my heart. It was the activity that I dreaded each year until my friends dragged me into it. I was ready to call it a day within the first five minutes of each and every Double Dash, but with my friends' encouragement, I persisted. This activity has taught me persistence. And it paid off in the end, because even I was surprised when I made it to the finish line on time. If I can make it to the end of the double dash while thinking it was over for me within the first five minutes, I can probably make it through a lot of other seemingly impossible tasks as well. This brings me back to the importance of experiencing new things and treasuring each and every moment. When you are just enjoying your life without constantly worrying about your future, you allow good things to happen to you and you subconsciously learn important lessons, like I did during the double dash. Even though everyone here has faced a lot of difficult decisions about their futures this year, I am hopeful that each one of us was able to just stop for a few seconds and live in the, live in the moment. After all, we had a lot of laughs this year. Last homecoming, last sporting events, last classes, last finals, last red and white night, and the last day. But with each last moment, a million cherished memories were made that make all of the hard work worth it. I encourage all of you to have a good time doing whatever it is you choose to do after you leave our game. Work hard, but always, always work with yourself to have the most amazing experiences and make the best memories possible. From the bottom of my heart, I wish you all the best of luck in your future endeavors. At this time, I would like to present an award that deserves special recognition. It is the Perfect Attendance Award. In order to receive this special award, a student has zero absences from school, no late arrivals to school, and no early dismissals from school. Not one hour, not one minute, not one second. To put it simply, he or she is perfect. This achievement is certainly a very challenging one to attain, and one that deserves this recognition. There is one of you that has been able to do it. Ladies and gentlemen, the award for perfect attendance, student attendance, over the course of four consecutive years goes to Vanessa Bonsu. Now please welcome our 2019 Senior Chorus as they sing Blackbird by John Lennon and Paul McCartney.
And now please welcome back the superintendent, Dr. Christopher Hiley, for the presentation of the senior class. Graduates, please stay seated until you hear the cue. Now for this time that the graduates have been patiently waiting for, in my official capacity as Rancocas Valley Regional High School District Superintendent, I hereby certify to the Rancocas Valley Regional High School District Board of Education that the collective members of the Rancocas Valley High School graduating class of 2019 have fulfilled all of the requirements prescribed by the state of New Jersey and the local Board of Education. Further, that they have at this time earned the right to be awarded a Rancocas Valley High School Diploma. Mr. President, it gives me great pleasure to present the class of 2019.
Please be seated. Thank you, Dr. Highlight. On behalf of the Board of Education, I would like to congratulate you on completing the requirements to graduate from RV. It has been with great pride we followed your accomplishments in the classroom in ROTC, on the athletic field, in the PAC Center, and all your other endeavors. It was our goal when you entered as freshmen that RV would provide you with an education that would enable you to compete in the world you are entering and provide extracurricular programs to help you grow and develop as young women and men. We wish you well as you leave RV and enter the next stage of your life, whether that be in school, the military, or starting your working career. And now it gives Mrs. Solon and me great pleasure to award the diplomas to the Raincoats Valley Regional High School graduating class of 2019. Xavier Hunt. Nicole Garrett. Gemma Isabel Chorus Saria. Kyle Ludley. Chase Dylan Capano. Alexandria Harrison. Kaylee Alondra Gonzalez. Charles Malik Lowe. Tyler Thomas Catanzariti. Anastasia Christine Wagner. Cameron Alexa Wimberly. Regis Lerdon Mason Jr. Yeah! Jordan Matthew Edwards. <laughs> Katana Nia Hanks. <laughs> Kelly Cueva. <laughs> ben Shire. Jeremiah Eli Curbello. Ashley Kilroy. Harmony Rogers. Carl Johnson. Daniel Maximilian Gribben. Natri Patel. Kaya Raquel Champion. John Rocky Romano. Manuel Brandon Gonzalez. Sydney Alexis MacArthur. Riley Marie Moses. Chris Higgs. Amori Steven Dos Santos. Catherine Lee Cooper. Kayla Grace Flanders. Jovan Marquis Warren Jones. Molly Ann Hill. Javier Luis Perez. Alvin Lopez Marin. Leah Nisbell. Emma Rose Dontremont. Kenneth De Silva. 
Bilal Ahmed. Aliana Ortega Smith. Sarah Madison Flynn. Owen Kennedy. Ronald Ray Thomas Jr. Kiara Wilson. McKenna Rose Farley. Daniel Arone. Nicholas Mark Del Prado. Crystal Hernandez. Maya Davis. Michael Joseph Krauss. Yeah, we're on the football. Ryan Patrick Swan. Sarah Elizabeth Seidman. Jillian Emily Catalano. Roman Dutillo. Jaya Scott Janone. Renicia Alexander. Brianna Nicole Perez. Zachary Scott Storr. Felix Augusta. Caitlin Rose Petricelli. Ayla D'Ambrosio. Yeah, we're on the right side at the top. Robert Lewis Augusto. Someone waving. Okay. Amon Dally Jones. Taylor Fly. Daryl Lamont Reeves. Avalonia Zaru Jones. Kiara Nakia Mangrum. Jamie Torres. Nathaniel Vargas. Amira Tiana Green. Kiana Jasmine Couch. Sean Patrick McGuire. Ethan Carlo Caminero. Priyana Alexis Snowden. Lucrezia Mays. Matthew James Ranelli. Rich Snyder Jr. Mukaya Nushe Warren. Destiny Allison Smith. Naeem Christopher Carter. Michael Austin. Sydney Mbane. Emma Bachman. Morgan T. Ward. Jonathan Edward Schmiel III. Nade Glover. Abby Meadow Ringo. Curtis Bonner. Christopher Smith. Asiana Monet Mile. Danny Jolie Ricucci. Xavier E. Tyson. David Diaz. Kiera Ari Pritchard. Haley Nicole Poinsett. Joshua Richard Spittler. Erica Christine Garfoli. Jamar Johnson. Jake Ryan Gathman. Yolanda Ayana Pacheco. Mary Caitlin Sharp. Kyle Ryan Anthony Wood. Nicholas Vincent Mapaton. Katharina France. Olivia Desiree Anderson.
Kyle John Priscavage. Alexander Thomas Nave. Amanda Marie Piazza. Noel Marie Agovino. Connor Matthew Norton. Anthony Moses. Layla Rose Williams. Morgan Olivia Morawski. Bubba Neil Canning. Daniel Alba. Jayla Dominique Goldman. Isabel Eliza Soto Delgado. Charles Robert Gaskill III. Connor Allen Brody. Alana O'Reilly. Helen Schuring. Rich, Rich McIntosh. Devin Lewis Edward Lawrence. Lauren Aliyah Satchel. Lauren Michelle Dickens. Julian Graham Arango Dunaway. Christopher Edward Cunha. Destiny Amira Conwell. Aiden Daly. Sabrina Gabas Deonson. Maya Mackenzie Jeffries. Maxwell Williams. Tanvir Rahman. Annalise Rochelle Campbell. Brooke Miranda Wimberly. Jaden David Butler. Jesus A. Solarzano. Nevjo Carr. Ahi O'Banner. Marcus Ryan Morales. Matt Blancoff. Mayez Akhtar. Courtney Allison De Silva. Ryan Thomas Parker. Grant Michael Van Emberg. Victoria Ann Lorenz. Gracie Esther Grundelin. Anthony Moore. Shane McKay. Emily Janae Richards. Kyla Renee Loudon. Jordan Ireland. Justin Kane. Allison D. Leali. Kayla Lynn Rosia. Jaleel Panter. Connor Valley. Rita Faseo Pausa. Ariana Shanice Villanueva. Donald Stylo. <laughs> Michaela Jean Johnson. Matthew Thomas Dwyer. Brandon Dean Roudenbush. Ashley Brooke Moss. Ashley! Alana Cien Reed. <laughs> Joseph Robertson. Anthony Albert Palin. Vanessa O. Bantu. 
Stephanie Mae Wadsworth. Edmund Robertson. Ty James Matlock. Jezzany Mercado. Ashley Rebecca Dragon. Khalil Walton. Troy William Tomash. Destiny Nicole Patterson. Kelsey Ann McCord. Ralph Anzano. Joseph Sawagat. Demaya Weekly. Idalis Elizabeth Nunez. Caden Kennedy. Matthew Alexander Kilkenny. Gizan Ucha. Gianna Christine Luisi. Joe Bass. Ryan Hine. Jordan Nicole Miller. Emerson Rose Steffi. James Cody Johnson. Kevin R. Tracy. Michaela Francis Caesar. Jeremy Joseph Jr. Mackenzie Paige Heckman. Josangeli Guzman Marin. Alexander Alcon. Brandon Ray Martin. Leisha Snively. Emily Francesca Fadala. Kyle Michael Kuna. Samin Bashir Holloway. Anna Higgins. Ajene Medina White. Damian Campbell. Kamal Elijah Sudlow. Amanda Faith Sakaris. Ashton Parisi. Jelani Jamal Bowman. Deja Monet Youngblood. Faith Nicole Thompson. Connor Pastor McConnell. Joshua Wallace Harmon. Hiba Urza. Natalie Jaden Robbins. Daniel Alexander Connors. She did with a side eye. Javon Raymond Laster. Amaya Pamela Nicole Wood. Samantha Mebs. Vince Tom Brown the second. Evan Thomas Schwartzman. Allison Marie Wright. Johanna Mackenzie Stevenson. Amelia Yatende Cortez Eats. Heather Ashley Kanicki. Tyler Marlin. Alex Robert Everard. Rosemary Robertson. Hannah Nicole Brooks. Dylan Michael Parker. Sean James Clothier. Sophia Michaela Rose Samantha. Alexia Clementina Goodwin. Oluwa Parami Suyemi. 
Kareem Josiah Moore. Mackenzie Ayana Smith. Dorothy Olivia Webb. Jonathan Thomas Womack. Laquan Palmer Brown. Kelly Granger. Callie McKenzie Adams. Justin Crane. Mason James Alderman. Brandy Matthews. Rebecca Annette Oliveri. Joshua Smith. Cameron Nicholas Schmidt. Amanda Marquis Wells. Aaliyah Nia Beeks. Patrick Raymond Haas. Justin Andrew Cirlante. Shauna Christine Nuss. Summer Lachey Bullock. Drew Charles Boker. Sean Patrick Lally. Sophia Lemma. Jayton Modi. Janae Bennett. Akayla Megan Carpenter. Nicholas Martin Manning. Ryan Morse. Destiny Ivani King. Nia Angelica Grant. Louis Angel Flora. Matthew Prescavage. Kamalpri Carr. Tenny Yanina Bello. Connor James Elliott. Anthony Dozier. Luna Maria Leonard. Sephora Haley Ferguson. Nicholas Steven Seibel. Devin Joel Melendez. Emily Elizabeth Tortorella. Taya Alexandria Denise Pierce. Albert Oset. Albert! Joseph Fasso. Marionette Vasquez. Ivana Robinson. Zachary Dylan Page. Matthew Alexander Frito. Teresa Marie Miller. Grace Caitlin Hahn. Bryce Gordon. Braden Xavier Green. Jessica Paul. Caitlin Rose DiFilippo. Kyle Sinclair. Grace Elizabeth Sterling. Cole Bernstein. Ryan Philip DeSouza. Jennifer Stamer. Heather Ann Martin. Hayden Alexander Smith. Kyle William Zhang. Ashlyn Sharkin. Grace Ann Clothier. Ronnie Davidson. Jonathan Najir Taylor. Nevaeh Ige. Julia Ann Mumbauer. 
Riley Murray. Adam Joseph Endress. Adam! Hannah Crawford. Dana Ann Condo. Luke Boring. Kyle Patrick Sweeney. Hannah Freya Gill. Olivia Lynn McElroy. Tyler Brewer. Aiden Patrick Daly. Dana Winston. Italia Marie Dredden. Ryan Joseph McKee. David Joseph Parenchi. Isabella Obern. Tania Alon Carter. Nicholas Pedito Jr. Daniel Christopher Myers. Christine Corridon. Harper Tap Sing Oil. Asan S. Saima. Naya Jai Bunch. Brandon Jackson. Aaron Anselmo Rivera. Jennifer Lynn Polios. Zoe Alexis Rodriguez. Sharon Hill. Kartik Mangatra. Percival Kaur Sonny. Victoria Ann Schultz. Cameron James Wallace. Ian Patrick Moore. Reed Dylan Carr. Ariel Champion. Ibukun Babulunda. Elijah Evan Dickerson. Ainu Chowdhury. Kitana Christine Kalimlin. Adam Neil Pumula Griffiths. Charlene Hudson. Brinjali Callion. Sean Platt. Casey Connolly. Caitlin Lee Keldrovich. Siobhan Marie Scafidi. Nicholas Mulke. Brian Ivine. Abigail Rose Warren. Cheyenne S. Van Nortwick. Pierce Wickenden. Sierra Donna Ingram. Bryce Taylor Mangini. Jack Peterson. Kaylee Elizabeth Eckert. Elena Rosa Harris. Thomas Mark Pancari. Miguel Alejandro Feliz. Ella Victoria Schultz. Valeria Christina DeChico. Trevor James Airgood. Aaron France Jameson. Sophia M. Tweed. Catherine Elizabeth Poor. John Preston Donahue. Samuel David Scott. Darren Aaliyah Minus Vincent. Hannah Rose Tui.
Thomas Schneider. Chadley James Jerome. Felicia Audrey Foote. McKenna McGrath Montgomery. Julie Gabriel Jimenez. Alex Heckman. Madeline Hannah Malone. Emma Francis Freeze. Ethan James Kraft. David Lawrence Jones. Madeline Rose Utz. Michaela Felici. Troy Dennis Plant. Micah Anson James Wood. Naya Nicole Anderson. Fred DeSillis. Tara Christine G. Selena Aponte. Quincy D. Allen McClellan. Joy Loren Bracken. Ava Rose Sarah. Essence Cromwell. Jesse Light Edric. Colin Hockman. Megan Lynn Bradley. Destiny Carmen Marie Cancel. Timothy Christian D. Antonio. Devante Adam. Brianna Lynn Bird. Sianna Caruso Laster. Anthony Hernandez. David Rogers. Alyssa Hollis Mad. Vanessa Allen. Sebastian Orion Dean. William David Black. Julia Marie Gambor. Destiny Bell Hayes. Landon Joseph Deaton. Kyle Matthew Lawton. Hallie Anna Korn. Ajane Wheel. Harmon Rancy. Dylan Chase Hollander. Kareen Marie Archambeau. Zyla Yasmin Cutshaw. Juan Zhu. Casey Bianca Don. Shane Derby Jr. <laughs> Gerald Hewitt. <laughs> Kayla Teresa LaRour. <laughs> Julie Lynn Klingler. Dylan Robert London. Cole Hoffman. Trinity Elaine Parker. Shelby Leanne Wall. Jack Anthony Sweeney the Fifth. John Edward Soderlin. Brielle Nicole Odin. Cameron Alyssa Tandler. Mandy Diol. Tyler James Rondomansky. <laughs> Kaylin Godshaw. Marielle, Marielle Annalise Wolfgang. Jason Obabor. 
Ashley Nicole Winton. Rebecca Elizabeth Doherty. Bethany Justine Biggie. Jameer Williams. Paige Carolyn Hammond. Ashley Marie Orendat. Madison Paige Corn. Matthew Logan Cologne. Kira Lene Key. Peyton Elizabeth Cole. Arlene Carr Gill. Jared Edgar Evans. Aaliyah Hunter. Emily Ann Horendak. Shelby Elise Lyon. Carlina Lay Flower. Noel Winter Langish. Layla Summerhays. Heather Ann Yamka. Evelyn Erin Town. Rachel Marie Flanagan. Rebecca Catherine Tato. Adriana DiFilippo. Lauren Pauline Parker. Erica Murphy. Eileen Elizabeth Cunha. Nasima Inez Jackson. Madison Lynn Dempsey. Najla Paris Cordon. Najla! Alexandra Daw. I'm gonna see you girl! Darvin <laughs> Remy. That's her mom. Gianna Aleppa. Maisha Malia. Gabrielle Powell. Javian Emmanuel Kendrick. Amanda Nicole Renner. Ajane Royale Russell Hopkins. Sydney Victoria Bordanowski. Grace Ashley Walter. Sabrina Koopa. Morgan Marianne Puglisi.